hello folks welcome to the wolf den looking at the laptop yep i just received this email today i thought it was pretty funny when i first saw it greetings this is a saltwater charter fishing influen influencers survey Wow, you have been identified by the FWC staff, which is the Florida Wildlife Conservation Commission, as a charter captain with significant social media presence. In an effort to reach a wider and more diverse audience about important fisheries topics, we are hoping to learn more from you and other charter captains about how we can work together to share the messaging of our anglers. We are asking you to please complete this brief sur survey to indicate your interest in sharing our messaging and what messaging format would work best for you. Thank you so much for your time and be uh, for your time and the part you play in supporting Florida fisheries. Now, I don't support Florida fisheries. I get, well, I support Florida fisheries, but at the same time, you know, don't blow smoke up my ass here. Let's see what these people are asking for. Begin survey now. All right, let me move this over here. It may squeak a little bit. Okay, saltwater fishing influencers survey i'm not sure if you can read it that is one squeaky arm i'm using for my gopro okay either way if fwc provided you messaging on some of our conservation ini initiatives would you be willing to incorporate that incorporate that into your social media posts I don't do social media posts. <laughs> Not really. Not really. I got a Facebook page and all that crap just for pretty much, you know, uh, search engine optimization. Let's see. Maybe we'll do a maybe on that. Okay, here we go. What topics would you be most likely to share information about? I'd love to write right in here. How you are screwing us over and not regionalizing important species compared to other places, i.e. speckled trout regulations. What topics would you most likely to share information about? I don't know. I guess I'm going to write don't know. Don't know. You're kind of catching me off guard. I don't have that much. I never gave it that much thought. How much do you like each of these options for providing content to you? Sent directly to you via email? Public web page with information that anyone can access? Private members only web page with login requirement? Oh no, not another login. Sent to me versus text message. Oh my God, now the God dang state wants to text me? Um, how about this? Uh, a little bit, email, public web page uh, that anyone can access? I don't know. Uh, a little bit. Private members only page? Absolutely not. Send text to me? Absolutely not. I don't want you people texting me. I don't I don't want anybody texting me. Okay. If 
we provide information directly via email, how often would you likely to receive these emails? Hmm, maybe every two weeks. Okay. If we created an online resource center that people could access themselves, how often should we change or update the available information? Mm, if it changes, then change it. I'd say monthly. If we created an online resource center, man, is this all like more bureaucracy or what? If we created an online resource center that you could access yourself, would you likely to be notified when this content is changed or updated? Yeah, I guess. I don't want to read old stuff. I'm going to adjust this a little bit more, folks. This isn't like it's really big, bold stuff going on here. But I thought this was kind of interesting to pass this on since they think I'm a big influencer. Well, I guess, you know, I mean, I got fishing videos. Um, I'm not an Insta face dude, you know, but what would be the most preferred format for any messaging that would be passing on to your followers? Mm. Video clips, sound bites, graphics, photos, correlating texts, bullet points, printable items, emails with templates can, that can be rebranded or forwarded, suggested posts. I don't know. A video clip would be good. And maybe, let's see. Emails with templates that can be rebranded or forwarded? I don't know. How about just photos? Graphics, maybe? Photos? No. They're going to show somebody else. And unless it's some chick in a bikini, I'm not interested. <laughs> okay. If you were willing to share our messaging, would you like some kind of recognition? Yeah. Since you got me working, this is called like working, Ooh, not winning. FWC will continue to explore this communication option. Would you be willing, would you be willing to work with us to develop this topic? Yeah, um, I'm willing. Please enter your email address to contact you and follow up research. Thank you for completing our survey. Well, you know, something like this. They piss us off and then they ask you for help. I mean, that's how I see this. And I'm going to let it be known. I mean, if maybe they see this. But you piss us off and then... You want to ask for help. I think that's what I'll let them know next time. Because it's not like I'm not pissed off when it comes to... They have these hearings, right? They've already done made up their mind when they have these public hearings, when they're going to change the rules. They don't care. They're kind of like Sleepy. Sleepy doesn't care about you. If they did... They'd be working for you instead of working to line their own pockets. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't have anything against the Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission. It's a whole lot better than the, what it used to be, the Florida Marine Patrol. Man, those guys, oh man, were they unbelievable back then. So I thought I'd just share this with you. It's one of these little tidbits of backdoor information I guess you could call it so thanks for watching